I mean, everyone always says that's kind of what you're meant to do. You're supposed to go to college, get married, have a few kids, and die. Mm, well, personally, I think it's a great idea. I don't see why you wouldn't do it. Well, for one thing, it's a fucking huge pain in the ass. Well, I think it's necessary. Well, I mean, it's just like, it's, it's just like such a serious next step. I don't like it. Well, I think it's, I think it's beautiful. I think everyone should do it. I think it's going to be blissful. It's a big subject. It's kind of hard to tackle. We're playing God here, okay? I'm not God. You're not God. None of us are God. None of us should be making this decision. <laughs> well, I mean, you'll never be able to masturbate again, so that's a big downside. You can't fucking masturbate anymore. And that's really the, one of the only things that matters in life, so, uh... Mm. Too many people aren't doing it. Your life just stops, so... There's just a really big potential for ending up really lonely. But, you know, it's a commitment. I think it needs to stop where it's at. I mean, if they keep going, like, what's next? Cats? Cats signing legal documents for this? It's fucked up. Of, uh, I don't, I just don't, I don't want to fill things out, you know, I mean, just the, the paperwork of it, just having to... Uh, fuck that. They don't even have thumbs. You know, like, I think having the, you know, the entire application everything you have to go through is, I think it's good for people because, you know, that way you have enough time to really, mm. you know, like, you it's can like, think about it. Yeah, it's like if you need to, you need to wait a week, you need to, like, register to buy a gun. Like, I've applied a couple times. I keep getting rejected. I don't know, they won't tell me why. Do you know if there's, like, an age limit or anything? Because, uh, my Uncle Ernie, he's like, He's getting really old now, you know. He still hasn't done it. Takes the magic out. I think it uh, makes it unnatural. I don't like the the government trying to get their hands on nature. Thanks, Obama. Yeah, yeah, definitely. That's I'm yeah, I'm ready. I'm definitely ready. I'm looking forward to it. Uh. Needs to. Why? I'm not going to. Never. Not me. Oh yeah. No, your boy is set up. My official date here. I mean, I'm pretty much ready now. Honestly, I was just waiting for the next Fast and Furious movie to come out. 100%. I'd love. I'd love to do it. I don't know. At some point in my life. I think I might want to go skydiving. I mean, it's an exciting last few minutes and then you're done. I'm gonna DIY, I'm gonna do it myself, you know what I mean? Once something done right, you gotta do it yourself. That's what Pop always said. Oh yeah, I definitely do it. And, and when I do it, I want to go out in a big way, you know? Something not too extravagant. <sighs> let's, you know, let's, <laughs> we'll... We'll cross that bridge when we get to it. <laughs> Emilio, Ricardo, Raphael, Lorena, Nicholas. Uh... Well, I'm not very close to them, but uh, every time somebody makes a decision like this, I cut them out of my life. This abuelita, you know. <laughs> I mean, you know, I'm a pretty young guy. Not a lot of them have really done it. I don't know. Less than, less than a handful, I guess. There's, there's Mark. There's Brian. There's Matt, there's the other Matt, you know, there's, uh, there's Jake. Oh man, Jake. Maybe like three. There's still a bunch of us around. There's also Dylan, Nikki, uh, fuck, I don't know. Luke, Damon, Chongo. Yeah, Chongo, he was a good one. Yeah. Um, three and a quarter. You know, my, my parents, you know, went through with it, you know, not too long ago, and even my, my older brother did too, you know, and so I feel like, you know, there's a lot of, you know, like, it's just like, it, it's like, it hits really close to home, you know, as far as, you know, my family and their decisions to go through with it, you know, so. Yeah, there's, uh, there's Daryl, Erwin, Kyle, did I already say Kyle? No. Well, there's the other Kyle as well, but yeah. Um, my friend who goes by Cyborg, you know, he, yeah. Pretty soon they won't need me anymore because everyone will just be, you know, living forever. I mean, capitalism's taking all the spontaneity out of it. No one's supposed to know when they're gonna die. No one's supposed to plan that. Fuck this and fuck everyone who 
he's not dying. It's like, my job's been outsourced. I can barely afford to feed my family. Yeah, death has a family.